Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can download and install Python pip, which is a package manager for Python packages. So in order to install pip for your Python 3 version, you just need to give these commands. So the first command you need to give is sudo apt update and then press enter and then provide your Ubuntu's password. So once the update command is finished, I'm going to clear the terminal and then give this command, which is sudo apt install python3 hyphen pip. And then it's going to ask you if you want to continue, I'm going to press Y and then press enter. So now the installation of pip for our python version 3 is completed so i'm going to clear the terminal once again and now we are going to check the version of pip which we have installed so just give this command pip3 hyphen hyphen version and then press enter and it's going to give you the version of pip which is available for your ubuntu operating system so once the installation of pip is finished successfully we are going to install a package called opencv-python using this pip3 command. So just give uh, this command pip3 install opencv-python and then press enter which is going to start the installation of this package which is opencv-python. So once the installation of this package opencv-python is completed, we are going to just check whether we can import the CV2 version which is available after the installation of this package using pip. So I'm going to clear the terminal once again and let's give the python3 command to open the python shell and then I'm going to import the CV2 package and then press enter and if it doesn't give any error that means CV2 is available for your operating system and to know the version of OpenCV available for your CV2 package, you can once again give this command, which is CV2 dot underscore underscore version underscore underscore, and then press enter. And you can see this time that 4.0.0 OpenCV version is available for your Ubuntu operating system. So this is how you can install a pip on your Ubuntu operating system. I hope you've enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next video.